I am Ravi, I work for Tata Singapore Airlines. I am Chief Innovation Officer and responsible for innovation in Vistara. Uh, innovation um, program of Vistara uh, is actually a value system. Innovation is one of the core values of Vistara. We try to do both kind of in, uh, innovation, process innovation as well as product innovation. Our idea is is, is multifold. One is to participate in the whole ecosystem of aviation and do our little bit in terms of improving it. Uh, our second uh, goal is to help Vistara to get a, give a better customer experience, uh, improve that experience continuously using technology or using process innovation. And um, our third and fourth fold ideas is to uh, create some sort of a disruption if possible, uh, uh, bring new ideas which will uh, take this particular industry a notch uh, forward. And there are multiple examples of that. We work with multiple technologies uh, ranging from blockchain, robotics, AI, uh, biometrics, uh, and so on and so forth. Our process innovation, we look at our, uh, we look at our processes uh, minutely and we try to find out uh, how we can improve it, uh, both from a perspective of productivity, uh, revenue generation, improvement of quality of uh, life of our employees, and, and many other uh, motivations. So Vistara has already, you know, Vistara's inception has been uh, quite new. It's, it's, a, it's a fresh, uh, new um, uh, organization. Um, uh, certain examples of innovation which are already in the public view. Uh, one is um, uh, our experimentation with robotics. Uh, we have arguably created first uh, robot for, for an airline, um, which is a combination of robotics and machine learning as well as deep learning. Uh, it is currently being trained uh, to interact with customers, to answer their queries, to help them to find out new gates to answer uh, any disruption which, which happens while they are at airport and so on and so forth. On the other hand, we have written an algorithm which is in the deep learning zone which, is, which goes beyond the instructional set of any airline which is uh, self-learning mode in which a uh, robot is uh, tuned or trained uh, to interact with humans. So that's, that is one example. Our sec second example which is again in a public eye where we are actually uh, we, have, we are working with airports, one which we have already launched uh, uh, in collaboration with uh, Bangalore International Airport is how to help passengers using biometrics for seamless uh, entry into an airport. So that's an example of how we want to collaborate within the ecosystem of aviation and take it notch forward. That's a biometrics example. A third example we have worked, uh, uh, we are working on a blockchain platform uh, so that um, cycle time and cost of training uh, and integrity of training of our engineering improves. This we are doing with the regulatory agencies and hopefully this will become another standard uh, using technology uh, for process improvement. Very soon uh, we will see how those experimentations are moving forward. So we use voice analytics, we are using voice to speech uh, conversion and intelligence related to that. Uh, from a data lake perspective, so that is other uh, take. We are also passionate about our colleagues and how we can improve lives of our colleagues, how, can we, how we can make it much more safer. So we have um, uh, another use case which is uh, in, in, the, in the final stages of maturity in an IoT zone. We are ensuring that um, a young uh, crew who work with us are they safe when they get out of their house until the time they reach airport and vice versa. So there are multiple use cases and you know it's not only you know business case oriented it is it is orientation is towards productivity, orientation is towards compassion, orientation is towards empathy, orientation is, to, uh, is towards the freedom of ideation which we give uh, to encourage this particular value and so that everyone embraces innovation as a core value in Vistara. We are a result-oriented organization. Okay. Uh, innovation has to produce results. But that doesn't mean that you know, we put tremendous pressure on ourselves or, 
a tremendous pressure on you know young innovators within Vistara. It's it's a very very young organization to do innovation. Our DNA is a garage style DNA. Okay? People come over here, um, they use our tools. We provide them tools. Sometimes we provide them budgets also. They are free for ideation. They experiment. Idea is to fail early. When you fail early, you don't waste too much of time and too much of material and you learn very quickly and you build something out of that particular learning quickly. That's one side of Vistara. We also encourage a startup in, uh, ecosystem. We did hackathon you know, a few years back and that one hackathon itself produced so much of startups uh, uh, for us and some of those startups are, are profitable uh, you know, companies today and mature startups today. And we take a little bit credit uh, for that because we encouraged it. So our ecosystem is both inward and outward looking. The success of, of the culture of innovation in Vistara, which I feel is far more important. Culture of innovation in Vistara is way more important than the actual results of experimentations. Now specifically coming to experimentation because that's one of the core uh, questions which you guys have asked. Um, uh, uh, these are initial stages, okay. Robotics, um, it's time will tell, but initial uh, results have been good. Uh, it was never done before. Today, uh, people uh, of almost uh, every age group, they are feeling, they are, uh, they are using, uh, they are giving critical feedback about our first robot, our second and third and fourth robot will have far more wider use cases, they would be far more complex, they will be far more accurate and all that stuff. Uh, um, biometrics, um, again it is an experimentation stage, initial results have been pretty cool. Uh, let's see where it takes uh, both airports and airlines combined together. Uh, hopefully it may become a standard. Uh, blockchain, again, you know, it's in the rolling stage, um, uh, you know, Initial results have been very, very good. Uh, operating cost savings have been indicatively uh, towards the goal which we are looking. Uh, and all these three, uh, remember, they are not just experimentation, experimentation. They are not like just simple pilots. They are in a production stage. They are in a public view. Uh, they are backed by strong tech. They are not uh, what I call as corporate pilots where insiders use it and then if it doesn't work they are in the public eye they are uh, they are cool tech they are cutting tech um, and their use cases are both internal and external okay now some of the other things which are in the initial stages for example you know um, how do we reduce the carbon footprint by using materials um, uh, uh, you know in flight outside the flight and all that stuff uh, how do we use robotics uh, for, uh, for, for diagnostics of engineering? Uh, can we use them? Um, how do we use uh, you know, um, uh, voice and, and quality of, uh, of, of voice conversation into indicative uh, AI-based sentiment and analysis? That is also in the experimentation stage. Um, how do we um, uh, uh, extend uh, blockchain platform towards area ranging from uh, loyalty uh, to MRO, uh, that is also in the experimentation stage. So, 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 so there's a lot of things which are happening. Uh, initial bets what we have made, all those initial bets have been good till now, okay. Uh, but they are experimentations, they are bets, uh, they, have, uh, they are organically done. Uh, when I say organically done, the ideation has happened within Vistara. Uh, uh, and, and there's a serious, serious, uh, you know, funding game.